I wanted to give you some sense of the production. It has a very specific feel, look, and spirit. It's a very striking, multi-tiered, flexible space. And the show itself functions, I think, in a unique way, the way that it brings visuals, music, text, the actors, movement, and design all together. orchestrated the whole thing. He wrote the whole thing, he orchestrated the whole thing. It's this wild cross between, I want to say, Germanic, almost Kurt Weill and Hank Williams. And these two musics just sort of come clashing together, but they blend as opposed to like, and it's kind of wild because you wouldn't expect that. It's, it's, I think, the next evolution in terms of like emo music. I really believe that. It is kind of its own artistic sort of thing because it's all about dealing with elements that you don't know and discovering new things and trying to sort of find some something to grab onto and hold onto and then also kind of blow away and create something new out of everything that was there before. Time is just a river, only fools try to paddle up that stream. Like with many Shakespeare plays, you see that these are recurring events and cycles in human history. There's a lot happening now that would parallel what was happening then. The lesson to be learned is obviously that if you don't learn the lessons of history, you're condemned to re repeat them. We will drink burning tears like wine. Say